drawing a picture of me and Ben. What do you think? Small! Small! Hey! hey, hey. Oh, hello, everyone! <laughs> Small, look what the postman's brought! Oh, what is it? We've won a competition! <laughs> Woohoo! They sent us prizes! <laughs> look, Small! It's cameras! <laughs> Here's your camera, Small! Thanks, Ben! A camera! Brilliant! <laughs> yes, and they're the kind that print the photo straight away. <laughs> so we can take a photo of us and put it on the wall. Come on then, Small. Say cheese. But I prefer tomatoes. <laughs> OK, then. Say tomatoes. Tomatoes! Oh, no, 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 no. Tomatoes makes you look gloomy. Cheese makes you smile. OK. Cheese! <laughs> hey! <laughs> Brilliant! Now do me, little cook. Now do me. Okay. Cheese! <laughs> Brilliant. Oh. Let me see yours first, Ben. <laughs> Whoops. Your head's missing, Small. <laughs> now let's see yours. It's a nice one of the kitchen, Ben, but I can't see you. <laughs> <laughs> we're not very good at this, are we, Small? <laughs> no, we're not, Ben. And I so wanted a picture to put up on the wall. How are we going to manage that now? Can't worry about that now, Small. We've got a customer. I'm on my way. Woohoo! Who is it, Small? Who's our customer? Oh, you'll like this one, Ben. He's got something with him that goes ch ch when he presses it. Oh, it goes ch ch. When he presses it, give us another clue, Small. I thought you'd get that one in a flash. <laughs> in a flash? Oh, I know. It's Phil the photographer with his camera. You're right, Ben. Now, what can we cook for a hungry photographer? I think it's time to look in my book. We need a story to help us cook. Let's take a look in Little Cook's book. Little Cook's adventures in the big world. Let me see. One day I was out for a stroll when I passed a church with the bells ringing. There was a wedding and the bride and groom and all the guests had gathered outside to have their photo taken. I stopped to watch as Phil the photographer got them all together. In a bit, and a bit more, and yep, just a little bit more, he said, waving them closer together until they were all in the picture. At last he was happy and pressed the button, but guess what? The moment the flash went off, a balloon blew by and two of the children forgot what they were supposed to be doing and ran off after it. <laughs> no, 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 Phil cried. That won't do at all. I, I need you all in the picture. Then he waved them back together until he was happy again and pressed the button. But just as the flash went off, a helicopter flew over and all the guests looked up to see what was going on. <laughs> oh, poor Phil. He couldn't keep the guests still. Phil the photographer was looking very sad. Then I had an idea. Phil needed something to make everybody keep looking at the camera, and I knew just the thing. I decided to do one of my famous dances. I stood on the camera and danced away, and when Phil took his photo, all the wedding guests were looking straight at the camera. The photograph was perfect. Thank you, Little Cook. I say that's the best wedding photograph I've ever taken, said Phil. Little Cook to the rescue once again! 
That was a great adventure. Oh, 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 oh. oh, well done, Small. Oh, I'd love to see that dance. Way! Would you, Ben? I could do it now for you if you like. Oh, yes, please. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant, Small. It makes me smile too. <laughs> well, you know, it's easy for me, Ben. <laughs> well, I wish that having ideas of what to cook for Phil was easy. You're right, Ben. That's not easy. That's hard. We'd better have a think. No, Big Cook's Big Cookery Book. Of course, the Big Cookery Book. There's recipes for everything in there. And where do we look for things to cook? In the book. In the book. In Big Cook's Book. <coughs> Here we are. Just the thing. Fish cake camera. Woohoo! And let's make it snappy. <laughs> Get it? Snappy like a camera. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, very funny, Small. OK, you read out the ingredients and I'll see if we've got them. OK, let's see. We're going to need potatoes. Potatoes, here we go. Potatoes, got them, Small. Yep. An onion. Here we are, onions. Boo-hoo, always make me cry. <laughs> Cucumber. Nice and cool. Cucumber, yep. Iceberg lettuce. Green iceberg lettuce, got it. Cherry tomatoes. Oh, yes, lovely cherry tomatoes. Nice and juicy. Yep, got the cherry tomatoes. A lemon. Over here, got the lemon. Yep. A tin of tuna in spring water. Here we go. Tin of tuna. Yep. Wholemeal bread. Here we are. Got the wholemeal bread. Yes. Wholemeal bread rolls. Oh, right. Wholemeal bread rolls as well. Got those small. And some oil. Got the oil as well. Here we are. Brilliant. Here we go, Small. Everything we need for the recipe. Fish cakes sound yummy, but I've never made them before, so I must find out how it's done. Good idea, little cook. And while you're away, I'll get everything ready. Brilliant! See you later. Woohoo! Hey, why don't you come along too? Whoosh! Go, Small! Go, Small! Whiz away! I wonder what he'll see today. I'm at the harbour by the sea. There's a fishing boat. The fishermen have sailed out to sea to catch some fish and they're coming into harbour. These crates are full of the fish they've caught. Wow, look at all the fish. This lady is going to make some fish cakes. There's the fish. Hey, that's mashed potato going into the mixer. What's next? Lemon juice. In it goes. And that's spring onions, all chopped up. Now for the most important ingredient. The fish. Turn the mixer on. Time to mix all the ingredients together. The mixture is pressed into a mould. Oh, that's clever. It comes out round. <laughs> the fish cakes are brushed with egg and then covered with breadcrumbs. The egg helps the breadcrumbs stick to the fish cake. One delicious fish cake. And now it's been cooked, it's ready to eat. Yummy! Angus likes his fish cake. I'd better get back to the cafe and tell Ben. There we go. Everything's ready. Way! I'm back. So you are, little cook. How were the fish cakes? Fishy, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I had a great time. I went to the harbour and saw all the fishermen unload the fish they'd caught at sea. Then the fish were used to make fish cakes and they look delicious. I can't wait to make some of our own. Then let's do it. We're all ready, so take a look. And we will show you how to cook. The jelly 
boats and pirates go Princess Pea Pies Carrot cakes and fruity smiles And envelope surprise We love our cafe and we love to cook We have a fantastic recipe book He is big cook and he is small Friends in our cafe we cook for them all When your tummy gets all rumbly You're ready for a treat You can make something delicious to eat Have you cleaned the surfaces? Yes. Have you washed your hands? Yes. All, All clean, clean and ready, ready to, to cook. cook. Do you remember the ingredients to fish cake camera? You do. There were potatoes. 300 grams cubed. Onion. Half sliced. Cucumber. Two slices. Iceberg lettuce. Two leaves shredded. Cherry tomatoes. One. Lemon. Half to squeeze. Tuna. 200 grams. Wholemeal bread. Two slices into crumbs. Wholemeal bread roll. One. And some oil. One tablespoon. Whoopee! Let's get started! OK, let's turn on the oven to 200 degrees Celsius. Gas mark six. Now remember, the oven is hot, hot, hot. So that's a job for your grown-up helper to do. And so is this. We're going to boil the potatoes for about 15 minutes until they're nice and soft. And while they're boiling away, we're going to fry the onions in the oil until they're nice and soft as well. Cheese! What? Oh, no! There's no cheese in this recipe, Small. There's no what? Cheese! Oh, oh what? <laughs> Where? Oh, 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 oh. I'm getting better at this, Ben. Look! Well, I haven't got time for that now, Small. I've got cooking to do. And besides, the flash always makes me go a bit funny. <laughs> OK. Oh, now, where was I? Oh, yes, OK. Uh, the potatoes and the onions are cooked now, and I've drained the potatoes through a colander. So I'm going to pour them into a bowl, like that, and then add the onions. There we go. And then we're going to mash them both together. Hoo-hoo! Mash them all up and mix them in together. Oh, this smells great. People take pictures of lots of different things, like their homes and their pets and their holidays and their friends, <laughs> like my friend Ben. There we are. And once it's all mashed, leave it to cool for a while. I'm going to take my camera on holiday with me so I can keep all the funny memories of Ben. Now, once the onion and potato is cooled, we can add the drained tuna and most of the breadcrumbs. And make sure you leave a few breadcrumbs aside for later. And then we're going to give them a good stir until it's all mixed up. It's brilliant! You can take pictures of anything. Have a look at these. <laughs> I think I need more practice. Now, grease a baking tray with a little oil. Small, could you do that for me? I'd love to, Ben. Great. And I'll start to make the fish cakes. So, I'm going to roll the mixture into a round shape in my nice clean hands and then I'm going to roll it in the breadcrumbs like this. There! Doesn't that look delicious? Slidey glidey oil is slippery! <laughs> Have you finished greasing that baking tray yet, Small? Oh yes, it's ready, Ben. Thanks for that, Small. Onto the tray. Oh, yes. Don't they look tasty? They look yummy! <laughs> <laughs> oh, small, I told you I didn't like the flash. Oh. That wasn't me, Ben. Really? How strange. <laughs> now, once the fish cakes are done, we need to pop them into the oven. So, oven gloves on. 
and over we go. Open up the oven and in they go. Now they need to go in for 10 minutes until they're nice and golden and that's a job for your grown-up helper to do. I'll set the timer for 10 minutes. On to the next job. Put one half of the bread roll onto a plate like this and then lay some of the shredded lettuce on top. Like this. Another photo, I think, small. I'm ready. Woohoo! Well, let's see then, small. Hey, that's pretty good, small. Thanks, Ben. I think I'm getting the hang of it now. <laughs> I wish I could get a picture of both of us, though, Ben. Oh, yes, that would be nice, but how could we do that? I don't know. The fish cakes are cooked and cooled now. Now, we only need one for Phil, so we can eat the rest later. Mmm, <laughs> they smell delicious. Oh, <laughs> they certainly do. Right, I'm going to pop one of the fish cakes on there, just on top of the lettuce, and then I'm going to take a slice of cucumber and put it on top as the lens. Then I'll take another piece of cucumber that I've cut into a square and pop it there as the viewfinder. That's the bit you look through. And then I can just take half of the cherry tomato and pop it there at the top as the button. And we'll just squeeze some lemon juice over the top to make it even more tasty. And there it is. Perfect. One fish cake camera coming through. There. All done. So what do we do now? Can we play? Not yet. Time to clean and put away. Hooray! Wash, wipe, scrub and clean. Make the kitchen sparkle and gleam. My name's Ben. And my name's Small. We've got the cleanest kitchen of all. Tidy all the bits and bobs, the things that help us do our job. Ingredients well put away, ready for use another day. Pots and pans will start to smell if we don't wash them really well. And now it's clear, let's all smile, we'll be finished in a little while. All around, up and down, we've got the cleanest cafe in town. Aha! Here comes the plate. Ooh! It looks like Phil loved his fish cake camera, Small. Look! He's left a note. Well, what does it say? What does it say? Let's see, shall we? It says, Dear Big Cook Ben and Little Cook Small, Thank you for my scrumptious fish cake camera. While you were cooking, I managed to sneak in and take the perfect photograph of the two of you together. It's a thank you. I hope you like it. From Phil the Photographer. Ho oh, ho, look small. It's the best photograph of us ever. A photo of Ben and a photo of small. Together! Oh, oh brilliant! See, See you soon! soon. Oh, ho ho! Big cook, little cook. Welcome to our cafe. Big cook, little cook. We'll cook for everyone. 